let's talk about our second habit, week two. And for seven weeks, we'll look at a new habit and follow it for the next month. In 49 days, we'll have seven new daily habits that may completely change your lives in a positive way, making you better at work, socially and at home. Each habit is simple and within the limits of everybody. So let's do it. Today's habit is learn something new every day. It might be something small or it might be a new course that will give you life changing experience. It's up to you. It could be as simple as how to make an omelet. It might be the start of a home study course that's going to last three or four years. And every day you'll learn something new. Life is a learning experience and we need to learn all the time. We used to talk about a job for life, but that is changing and retraining is a theme today. So now we talk about lifelong learning. Many people are changing their jobs every few months or couple of years because they're on short term contracts, short term projects, or maybe they're made redundant or are looking for promotion. And for these people, it's usually essential to be on a learning roller coaster. One minute they're having to learn for a new job, then they're settled in. This roller coaster isn't such a steady ride. And that's what I want to sort out here. By making learning a daily habit, you'll stay ahead of the game. My son writes computer programs and he told me all the guys he worked with take courses all the time because they're afraid they'll lose out and get out of touch. So all the time they're buying short courses, they're watching short free courses, they're buying books. Another group of people who need to undertake annual training are professionals who need to keep their professional status. And that's what you should be trying to do. Keep up in your place of life. Whatever your job, you need to keep learning. It is really, really important. In fact, we all talk about learning for life. Do you feel you know everything you need to know? Everything to get jobs done, everything to get along that you don't need to bother anymore. If you are, then you're unique for everybody can be better by learning. It's a fact we never stop. Maybe there's a physical skill you want to learn, like maybe photography or painting, gardening, driving. Perhaps you feel inadequate in a social skill like being able to talk in public. You don't feel confident. You'd like to manage others, or you'd like to be a better team leader. You can learn all these things. It's just a question of finding how and doing it. So why not sit down and list five things you'd like to learn about and why, and why you want to learn that particular thing. Now put them into order and think about the subject at the top of the list. Now you can think about how you're going to learn about this so put a little bit of thought to that. Do that at the end of the video. Now you should get a book from the library or buy one maybe. They said only two books in every hundred that are bought are actually read. Some are read and just started, but many aren't even opened. And that's very, very sad. They also say that if you spend just one hour a day reading about anything, then you become an expert in 12 weeks. That's just 84 hours. And by expert, we mean you'll be able to talk with authority about whatever it is. You'll know a lot more than the average person. You'll have confidence about that particular subject. You might learn by looking up the information on the Internet. You'll find many articles and videos on almost anything. And this is a common way to learn. And there are free courses and there are paid courses that will help too. And by the way, courses are so much better than random videos and articles on the Internet because they are structured and complete and they're probably more factual as well. A lot of the stuff on the Internet, you, you've got to check it out to make sure it's accurate. You might join a local night school or day classes. And if you're particularly enthusiastic, you might even sign up on an open university home study degree course. And wouldn't it be exciting to tell your family and friends you've just been awarded a degree? That's absolutely fantastic. I know several people have done that and their lives have changed dramatically. 
Learning something new will keep your mind active, make you more interesting, and it will widen your knowledge. It might even give you skills that will have other advantages. If you learn skills like decorating, car mechanics, gardening, plumbing, then you could save yourself money at home or even turn it into a second income and teach others. Just remember, we can all learn all the time and will benefit. If you learn one small thing every day, you can only benefit in every way. So that's really important. So remember, if you're unwilling to learn, no one can help you. But if you're determined to learn, no one can stop you. Make today the first day of a new learning plan. Take enthusiastic, positive action and do it now. And as I suggested before, sit down and list out the five things you'd like to learn about now. And make this your new habit that you will use every day from now on. So good luck. Do give it a try. Try to keep up with it. And then in a month, it'll be a habit. And by the time you've finished in 12 weeks, you'll have completed something pretty marvellous. So all the best.